ourselves to another listen, day in the gym where to we can this. make some now, changes we're working to the body. Today, don't you think? It's chest. Sure. Well, I just want to know what we're we doing today. We're working out. Chest, you know, shoulders, get my and out arms. Of okay? We all get the pumping, get the pumping, and the high, and the high, and the high. You know what I'm saying? We got to get yeah. it together. You, you know what I'm saying? We have all these equipment in Jeez. here. We're gonna pop, 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 pop. We're gonna use the bands. We're gonna pull. We're gonna pull. And then we're gonna do all these things. Are you listening to me? Are you paying attention? Yes. Oh my gosh, I think he's dangerous. But anyway, so we're gonna do the chest. You know, we're gonna do so the fat. arm. You know, we're gonna go to the beach and go like this. And see the beaches over there. You know, it's over. There and ah, we're gonna get the abs right. Yeah, make sure we do the hit, 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 hit training. And then after that, we do the oof, 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 crunch. You know what I'm saying? The oof, oof, crunch. And then we hit the weights. We're gonna curl, we're gonna curl, we're gonna curl. Let's go be magnificent. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Okay. So this is where you at, bro. Here to bring to you another workout. As you see by my two alter egos, we're working our chest, shoulders, and arms. And for our first tricep, which is three movements back to back, we're doing incline dumbbell press, we're doing flat dumbbell flies, and then we're doing Smith machine on the bench. So we're using the machine today. So hopefully you're ready, because today's gonna be magnificent and marvelous. Let's go. All right, couple cues for this. Abs tight. Have the bench inclined, meaning facing up a tad bit. And what you wanna do is, when you get to the middle, you wanna squeeze your chest. So squeeze it inward, and we wanna try to push it inward. Try to get your elbows to touch each other. Now we know that's physically impossible to have your elbows touch, but that's the mentality I want you to have. Try to make your elbows touch each other. Now it cause you to get a good squeeze in your chest. So that's what we're doing and try to not just rack them out, but you try to have a nice pace while you're doing it. So with all that talking being done, those are the cues. Let's go ahead and hit it, guys. Ooh. All right, here we go. flies cue same thing abs tight and what you want to do here is you're going to turn the dumbbells to where they're flat touching each other you'll see that in the movement um, squeeze at the top all squeeze at the top squeeze that chest muscle um, keep your arms as straight as possible well you see um, half of the way when you get down it's not going to be straight uh, but it's going to be a little, uh, um, the arm is going to be, it's going to be bent when you're, uh, coming back down. So just, just watch what I'm doing. I'm going to give the cues in the description, I have more details during that time, but just watch the movement. And you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. All right. So here we go. So when I say flat, I mean here, this is the flat for me anyway. That's what I'm saying. So what you're gonna do here, try to keep it straight as straight as possible, and let's bring them down. Here we go down, bend a little bit, back up. What you're gonna do is when you feel a good stretch 
that's when you're gonna come back up. Cause again, you're not trying to hurt yourself, but you just need a good stretch from your chest. You're gonna bring it back up and you squeeze, try to squeeze your elbows together. And that's gonna cause you to flex that chest muscle. So, all right, with all that, let's go ahead and rack them out. <laughs> I mean, well, I should say, uh, let's have the weight come down to our mid of our chest here and try to flex it out. And as always, we're going to push the bar inward, push the bar inward to engage our chest muscle. And that's what we want to do. All right, here we go. Uh, Arch the back a little bit. There we go. tricep fam here we go for the next one it's another tricep so what we're doing is Arnold press and then we're doing a dumbbell shrug you see that shrug not necessarily like that but shrug and then after that we're doing rear delt band flies supposed to be on the machine I don't have the machine for it so we're gonna use bands that's gonna be alternative for the machine so no other than that Let's go ahead and go. All right, let's go. All right, with Arnold press, it's pretty much like a dumbbell press, but you're turning the dumbbells in. So, um, abs tight, back against the seat as much as possible. Try to keep, again, keep your core engaged for this, uh, so that it can um, keep you straight up. You don't want to be slouching or bending over. All right, so now lift the weight up. Well, here, you're gonna end like this with the dumbbells or your palms facing you. So you're gonna go up, turn, press out, and bring it back in. And that's the Arnold press. So let's go ahead and rack it out. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, guys. So with the shrugs, <sighs> core tight. Sound like a broken record, but core tight. Now, what you don't want to do is you don't want to roll your shoulders. You want to squeeze it up, and then you want to bring it back down. And that's pretty much the movement there. You're shrugging your shoulders up as high as possible. We're not rolling it. Front row backwards, we're going up and down. And try to squeeze at the top. All right, so let's go. <laughs> And that's how it's done. Now, we're on to our final, final, final tricep. So what we're getting ready to do for our final tricep is close grip bench press with the machine, which is a Smith machine, and then we're moving on to skull crushers, and then we're gonna finish off today's workout with double rope press down. Yes, I'm so excited, because we're at the end. We're at the end. I love working out, um, but I'm also excited to be, to be done and to complete a workout because, man, I am trying to get this body ready for the summer. Better yet, spring break. We'll see. But anyway, trying to get it all together. So you do what you got to do. I do what I got to do. We share information, and we both grow. If you haven't done so already, fam, give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Leave a comment down below and share this video with a friend. All right, but other than that, let's go ahead and hit this last tricep. All right, people out there. So like I said, this is a close grip bench press. Now, there's a lot of uh, people who think that doing close grip is mainly for the inner part of the chest. Shoot, I thought that for a while. But really, what you're, kind of, what you're working out here is your tricep. Triceps on this one, sorry almost I had to burp but anyway it's working out your tricep so that's the main focus muscle in here yes you're still working out your chest because of the position that you're in but this is mainly a tricep tricep workout so keep your keep your core tight try to bring the weight down as close to your chest as possible don't hurt your wrist in the process so go as low as you can and again try to flex that tricep at the top of the movement so let's go ahead and get it so for me, I don't like to get too close because one of my wrists is uh, kind of injured and I can't go that low with it. So I leave a, a decent amount of space. For my bar, I have like a little sit apart that's uh, shaded kind of different. So I try to go there or I try to do it to where my thumbs meet each other. So I'm going to go with thumbs uh apart and then from there we can go ahead and pull this up and i might adjust it depending on how my wrist feels after doing this all right let's go Elbows in, abs tight. When you're bringing the weight back up, not straight up, 
but at an angle away from your body. So let's go ahead and hit it. Oh. down another fave of ours that we've normally done another tricep workout all right abs tight you're gonna bring your elbows down to your side and then like a ball in hand you're just moving our forearm uh, part of our arm down and we're going to flex at the bottom squeeze at the bottom so to bring that to our side and down keep it together no rocking another workout i'm so excited if i could sing i'll sing right now but i'm not finna hurt you guys ears by me trying to bellow out some notes because i'm not good at that but we just hit chest shoulders and arms mm, 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 mm. we just did that so i'm so excited guys i'm so happy for you because i know you killed that workout so if you enjoy the workout give your boy a thumbs up Hit the subscribe button as well. Leave a comment down below and share the video with somebody else. Share the love. So guys, I love to hear from you. I like to know what you think of the workout because again, it motivates me because I need your energy to push me to keep on doing it. Because guess what guys, I love working out, but some days I get into a little funk where I don't want to do anything. So seeing you guys comment, seeing people tell me that, yo, uh, you're doing a great job. I'm getting my workout in. I'm losing weight, blah, blah, blah. I love hearing those type of comments, guys. So let me know what you think about the video. If you have some tips for me, share it. Because guess what? We're all trying to help each other out. If you think I'm doing something wrong, you got the proof to show, to, you know, to prove it to me, man, I'll be willing to change stuff up. Because guys, I just want to make gains. I want to get this body right. I want to help you get your body right. And we do this together. So let me know what's going on out there, people. Or should I say fam? But as always, this is where you at, bro. Signing out. Peace. See you on the next workout.